This is 27-year-old Amy Maria, very much her own woman. And there's a reason for that. I'm half Italian and I have a serious temper. <laughs> Supposedly. Love is picking people's spots <laughs> for them. I don't need a man. That's the thing as well. I'm so comfortable, but I'd like a man. You're looking fantastic. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's a pleasure. pleasure. So are you. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to have the company of a guy and go out and have fun with a guy on dates and be able to have somebody to cuddle at night. You're expecting much? No. Good. But I'm expecting him to be... OK. OK. <laughs> That'll do. Well, confidence is good, though. Confidence, but not cockiness. That's it. It's a thin, That's li it. thin line there, There's right? a very thin line. Yeah, I noticed. Hi, how are you doing? My name is Phil, I'm 32. I'm a personal trainer. Some of you guys might remember me from California. Five years ago, Phil was a reality star and a notorious playboy, but he's changed now. He's no longer a reality star. A lot of women always seem to ask me, how many women have you slept with? That's, for some reason, a question that I get asked so many times by girls, and I, I find that a very personal question. Say about 100 girls. I don't know if that's good or bad. Hi. Hey, how are you? Good. Nervous. I don't want people to see me as just this guy who was on a TV show. I like to go out with people to know me from me as actually a genuinely nice bloke. I'd like a girl to see that, you know. I think I, I've matured a lot from three or four years ago. I am still a lad who goes out and does like to pull women until I meet the woman of my dreams, you know? Your name is? Hmm? Your name, please? Phil. Phil. Top form? Top form. A game. Top, top form. Top, top form, top, top, dog. top dog, eh? Top, top dog, top form, top dog. <laughs> Even though I'm a little bit hungover, I had a few drinks last night, so I'm a little bit hungover. Yeah, don't tell her that. No. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I'll say nothing about yeah. that, eh? Yeah? I like a girl to be a little bit shorter than me. Um, someone who's bubbly, kind of happy, maybe some blue eyes, and... Nice bum as well. What well, lad doesn't like a nice bum? You know? Maybe a little bit of tongue as well, Sean. Just a little bit of tongue. Not too much. All right, senorita. Hi. Hi, how are you? Nice, nice to meet you. Meet you. How are you? <laughs> What's your yeah. name? Phil. Phil. Your name? Amy. Amy, nice to Amy. meet you again. Second time. Where are you I from? I recognize you. Do you? I'm not going to say nothing till you, till you say it. <laughs> you from California? Yeah. No way. Yeah. I am, yeah. yeah. I recognised him from being one of them guys. People who want to get photos with him or whatever. That's what it was. His tattoo has put us together. Yeah, that's what it is, yeah. They've got, like, a tattoo going all around here. I won't, I won't even ask to see no. that now, yeah. <laughs> that takes a few days. Yeah. Now, I Sex on a first date, a lot of people have a stigma around that, that if the girl sleeps with you on the first date, that she's a bit of a... She's a bit of a slut, maybe, you know? I beg to differ, you know? If, if it's meant to be and you find each other extremely attractive after a few drinks, there's nothing wrong with it. No. No sex on a first date. You gotta work for the cookie. <laughs> what kind of girl are you looking for? Just someone who doesn't take life too seriously, you know, just, right. just okay. someone who wants to have a bit of fun. If I'm trying to see somebody, I'd, I'd wait a few dates. Let them get a taste of you a bit by bit, and then, <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.